Hey everyone, this is Sai here from Data Ants. Um, welcome to my channel. Today we'll be going over an important feature, um, or I would say an enhancement to the existing reporting inside NetSuite that has been announced, I guess, a couple of years back, but is coming to fruition now, which is nothing but the NetSuite Analytics Warehouse. Um, NetSuite seems to call it NSOC. So uh, I was at Suite World this year, and there were a couple of important announcements that I feel like are relevant to this conversation. One of them being NetSuite plus AI, so which is going to change how we interact with NetSuite and how we take action based on the insights and recommendations from the system. So what I, I'm going to give you guys an overview of what NSAW is currently. So you could see how there are some fancy graphs here that are possible inside NetSuite through like analytics or even reporting to an, to an extent, but this NSAW or the analytics warehouse gives you the ability to like slice and dice beyond just the regular set of charts. So you can see you have all your like dimensions um, on, your, on your left here, followed by like the measures at the bottom. So you have your facts. So at the transaction line, so similarly, you can add in any extra data sets to this. So you can add data, you can create additional calculations. So um, yeah, there are a bunch of uh, visuals that I believe Oracle NetSuite is trying to like basically make it a solution that is going to compete with like the likes of Power BI or Tableau. So um, be on the lookout for this. I'm trying to build out a course um, for NSAW that is uh, going to be more like a, of a beginner course. So I'll definitely keep you guys posted on the same. So this not only has like um, like data elements to it, so you can slice and dice, you can use things as a filter. Um, so you can get to the bottom of like of the visuals that you want to view. So you can click on use as a filter. Um, you can drill down. And also there's aspect of this going to be published back inside NetSuite. So you don't have to come out to a separate link to access the analytics warehouse. So I find it pretty cool. And uh, the best part is you can export it to anywhere, uh, either a file like or like you can print it out. So, so you can do it as a PDF, um, CSV. There are multiple options of, available here. And I've also noticed when I was playing around with this is like the, uh, the formatting options um, to make the visuals aspects as perfect as possible. Yeah, there, there's forecasting in it. There's like, you could do, there's machine learning, AI, embedded AI in, inside this. And um, it's all built out on the Amazon, like sorry, the Oracle Cloud. So, which is aut automatically secure um, when um, you have your information being refreshed out of NetSuite. So you can present this visuals here like it kind of reminds me of Tableau, uh, where you have that story um, dashboard uh, format. So it's something similar. So in, in terms of this is being called a canvas, where you can use your data, build out data sets. Um, so you have your time. So customer. So you would have to be familiar with the NetSuite data sets. Or you can also definitely use the record browser to understand your data better. and. The good thing is you don't need to understand the custom fields for this. You just have to know the label of that field inside NetSuite for the same. Yeah. So one other thing that I found uh, pretty interesting is you can analyze the data from different viewpoints, right? So you can like not just by say invoice value by top 10 customers or like I could do invoice um, by like the items maybe by location you know, um, by account, by, again, uh, by subsidiary, which is always already here by department. So you can slice and dice as, as you need it. Um, one more thing is you can connect NSAW to NSPB or like your planning and budgeting tool. So to view uh, your budget versus actuals and do additional analysis as needed as well here. So you can also go to like industry specific analytics, right? It doesn't have to like stick with one particular um, I would say analysis. So you see, I have brought in all of the data from NetSuite. So they come out and like it is, again, you can set the refresh frequency for the same. So you get all the different transaction 
types are on the system available for you to do your analysis on. So I found it pretty intuitive and useful if you're someone who is going to work on top of um, the NetSuite data and the, the ability to like connect to third party data sources is also a huge win for NetSuite. And um, for people who are not too in, involved in like, you know, building out a data warehouse using like say an external tool like Power BI um, to build out, uh, you need to basically have a data model in place for that and then have your reporting built into Power BI. So this provides like an easy enhancement to your uh, existing NetSuite data. So um, yeah, please let me know your thoughts and I'd be happy to like implement it for you guys if you or your if your clients are interested in uh, having a demo of NSAW. Um, we would love to partner with you guys and work on implementing this for you and provide insights and advanced analytics. Thank you all.